Good morning, Antoinette and Doug. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. The new reality for the next eight weeks out here. And as you mentioned today, could really be that first real test of the Sumner Tunnel shutdown as many drivers head back to work after the 4th of July holiday. Now, what we do know is there is some good news out here. The State Highway Administrator says repairs are on track. The 24-7 project is designed to extend the tunnel's lifespan by 50 years with routine maintenance. Drivers say while crews are working around the clock, their commutes have become unbearable. Since the, the tunnel is closed, I've had to take the Ted Williams every day, and it's been about you know, an extra 30 minutes or 40 minutes on, uh, on top of what we used to do, plus a lot of frustration. We expect during the heaviest days to see very widespread congestion. The city is providing a number of free or discounted alternatives for commuters, including free blue line service and discounted ferry service. If today is your first commute since the closure, you may want to consider those options, though some officials are warning that tomorrow may bring even heavier traffic based on recent patterns. So drivers, good luck out there. Be patient. We're live in East Boston, Brown and Borky, WCVB News Center 5.